Hello everybody, it is uh, Pete here with MTG Peatster and we are doing match two here with our modern burn deck. Let's go ahead and start. So far we're 1-0. Uh, and oh. We played Death and Taxes. It was a uh, pretty fun couple games. Oh boy, let's see. Keep it. That's a little risky. We we have a few one drops. Um, we really need one more land. Pretty much any one will do. Um, I want to get in with a swift spear to start, um, and we want to get stomping ground. Because most of my white is the sideboard, and I mean it'll make, um, oops. Uh, and it'll make my Nactal hit more um, and harder to kill. But we can uh, we can wait. I'd rather get him out and going. Because these other things all kind of work off. I'd kind of rather them use a uh, kill spell on him like that than on me. So Meyer bolts, basic mountain. Oh, there we go. Um, don't know what they're playing yet. I'm gonna go get that. And I'm gonna do that. Now we're gonna get into the three. On the next turn, we'll drop him because <clears throat> we've got most of our one drops out of our hand. So I like dropping the idol on there um, to force him to take damage with removal. Um, and if not, we're going to end up taking some damage just to get him dead faster. Um, I'm not going to... Never say I'm not going to drop the guide. Because I want to be able to use this to pump him up and save him in case he gets bolted or something, which we can do. And we can do three to him anyway. Okay, um, well, he didn't do anything. I'm wondering if we're playing against Scape Shift. Let's suspend that. Drop him.
Okay. And that is escape shift. Uh, Titan, uh, the cult, something like that, I'm pretty sure. Okay, he gains a life. That's not going to be enough to save him. Okay. He scoops. So, escape shift. Let's bring Skullcrax in here. Um, might run a blood moon. Or something like that. I kind of like the firewalkers too. Um, we may need those. So, you don't want to pollute too much, though, because, well, for one thing, I know that we definitely don't need our other Grimlock Master. He's going to have some kind of, uh, wrath effect, I'm pretty sure. Which kind of makes me feel like I should be taking guys out. Um... Which guys do we take out? I almost want to take the Nactyls out. And add some burn. Um, got a little bit more time to think about this. I wanted to bring Searing Blaze is not the best burn spell in this situation, so we would rather have a couple of destructive robbery. Um, I don't even know if we need it, but at the exile. I mean, it's not going to hurt us that bad if he does Blood Moon. So I almost kind of don't think we really need that. Paths. You know, let's put these guys back in just for damage. Let's do something like this. Let's just try this. Let's see what happens. I like being up a game. <clears throat> We're not on the draw, or we are on the draw, so it's going to be a little slower. Okay, I'm going to try to do this again. We're going to keep it on a one lander because we've got these three cards that can interact with him favorably. And once I hit two, uh, and even less. Okay, so Rift Bolt for one on suspend. Um, in here, I think, again, we go get the um, Stomping Ground. And we pretty much get the basic mountains after that. I don't really, f I should have taken Goblin Bat out. I don't like giving Escape Shift type decks free land. He might even have some landfall game life stuff. He probably does. So we need to get... Okay. See, that's a guy that we wouldn't even have wanted to swing blaze in here for. That's good. Um... Drop him now. Drop him now. Okay, let's get in there. That might not have been a very good play, um, considering. 
likelihood of him having something like pyroplasm or anger of the gods. Alright, I need to think a little bit more before I make my decisions. That was a very risky play on my part. And for two damage to him, it just doesn't make any sense. Let's see what he does, though. Do Tarkus command because I don't put him up to a three four. Why would he kill him? Um, but let's see, that my guy doesn't have first strike, huh? Um, I think we do need to to get rid of it. Let's get rid of it. It is six to him, but I can't kill that. Um, oh, wait a minute, yes, I can. Yes, I can. I'm freaking blind. Anger of the Gods is going to whack my guys out, but... Hmm. The game's not over yet. <laughs> 
learn how to play. I can't believe how long this game's already going on. These are supposed to be fast, right? Fast, quick games. Gate shift. Not. Turn a creature or land from a graveyard. Wow. That's annoying. Past that. Um, Here. It just got too out of out of the way. Um, what did I do wrong? So I don't mind destructive railroad as bad as I didn't like it before. Now that I saw what it can actually do, but um, yeah, I didn't like having the goblin guides in there. For Come back in here. Um, Swing place still is not gonna. Um, yeah. Um, I want the paths. It would give me more. Uh, Fuck wants to get the tight now, it's pretty much lights out. Alright. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do it. 21st, yes. Okay, we've gonna keep it. Tell me now. Yo. I think I hit 
put idle on him into play. There's the 12. I just want to hold off a turn before I put that because I've got the. Let's just wait. This is really the only instant um, spell I can cast right now. Then it wouldn't actually say it in them. I know he has a lot of life gain, that's why I don't want to use it yet. But if I'm going to cast him next turn anyways, it's like... Well, that's it. You got me. <clears throat> that stinks. Okay, well, there we go. It is one and one. 